What is money, really? Is it those crumpled dollar bills in your pocket? Or is it something far more mysterious, a shadowy force pulling the strings of the global economy? Well, get ready to have your mind blown because we're about to dive deep into the wacky world of finance. Let's explore the legal definitions, the historical shenanigans, and the surprising truth about your cash. Trust me, this isn't just some economics lecture. So buckle up, because we're about to embark on a wild ride through the world of so-called money. By the end of this, you'll not only understand the basics of finance, but you'll also be armed with enough knowledge to impress your friends at parties, or at least confuse them. Either way, it's a win. It's a According to Black's Law Dictionary, money is a medium of exchange authorized or adopted by a government as part of its currency. Money comes in various forms, from the physical cash we all know and love to the digital digits residing in our bank accounts. There's also cryptocurrency, which is like the rebellious teenager of the money world, constantly challenging the status quo. For now, let's focus on the basics. We've got money of account and currency, two terms that sound incredibly similar but have distinct meanings. It's like the difference between your Instagram profile and your real life one is a carefully curated representation, while the other is more authentic. So what's the difference between these two monetary masqueraders? We'll get into that in the next section. Think of it as a financial duel, with money of account and currency battling it out for supremacy. Who will win? Stay tuned. Imagine you're at a farmer's market. You wanna buy some apples and the farmer says they cost $1 per apple. The dollar in this case is the money of account. It's the unit of measurement we use to determine the value of things. Now you can pay for those apples with actual dollar bills, currency, or you can whip out your phone and use Apple Pay. Both methods represent value, but one is physical and the other is digital. So money of account is the abstract concept of value, while currency is the physical or digital representation of that value. It's like the difference between a recipe and the actual cake. One is the blueprint, the other is the delicious edible result. To put it another way, money of account is like the points in a video game. They represent your progress and achievements, but you can't actually spend them in the real world. Section four, Federal Reserve Notes and the Fiat Frenzy. Let's talk about those dollar bills you carry around. They're called Federal Reserve Notes. Our currency was once backed by gold. You could exchange paper money for gold. Then came the Fiat Frenzy. We abandoned the gold standard for fiat currency. Fiat currency isn't backed by any physical commodity. Its value comes from government decree and public confidence. Remember, your money is a promise backed by the US government. It's a symbol of our collective belief in the system. Section 5, HJR 192 and the Great Debt Escape. In 1933, Congress passed House Joint Resolution 192, a piece of legislation that had a profound impact on our monetary system. This resolution essentially outlawed the use of gold clauses in contracts, paving the way for the modern fiat currency system. One of the key implications of HJR 192 is the distinction between discharging and paying debts. Before HJR 192, debts were paid with actual value, like gold. After HJR 192, debts are merely discharged with legal tender, which is essentially a promise to pay. This legal maneuvering is further reinforced by 31 USC 5118, which states that Federal Reserve notes are legal tender for all debts, public and private. So, what does all this mean for you? Well, it means that your money is essentially a promise, a social contract that we all agree to uphold. Section 6. Your wallet secrets revealed. We've explored money's forms, legal definitions, and historical transformations. Uncovered the difference between money of account and currency and Federal Reserve notes. Money is more than just crumpled bills in your pocket. It's a complex system of value, trust, and legal frameworks. Stay tuned because the world of money is full of surprises.